Okay, let's talk personal pronouns. And as you know, the subject of a sentence is usually, or very often, a person. Uh, but it doesn't have to be. It can also be a personal pronoun. And the subject case you know already is always the nominative case. Uh, the accusative case is for direct and dative for dative case for indirect sentence objects. And we'll get into that later on a bit more. There are three ways to say you in German. Du, ihr, and sie. Uh, the first one is the informal singular, du, then the informal plural, you guys, ihr, and a formal you, which is sie. And if you address someone in writing formally, you capitalize the S. OK, again, two ways to address people formally and informally. And it is far better to be cautiously polite and use the formal Z and wait for um, the older or uh, person in authority to offer the informal do. And you notice the uppercase Z, which I mentioned already in written German. Even though it is a pronoun, it is capitalized. And here we have all the pronouns uh, in the nominative case, uh, the subject case, accusative and dative, indirect or direct and indirect objects. So I'll read them for you so you know how to pronounce them. Ich, du, er, sie, es, wir, ihr, sie, and sie. You notice all the z's for, as we said, they, for she, singular, for they, and for formal, you, singular, and plural. Then the accusative, the ich, turns into mich. Ihn, sie, es, uns, euch, sie, and sie. And the dative, mir, dir, ihm, ihr, ihm. Plural, uns, euch, ihnen, and ihnen. And you notice again, it's capitalized in writing. 